Welcome to BM Dooney Farms. In this video, we will demonstrate how to use oxalic acid vapors to treat for varroa mites. The following items are items that will help assist in this process. A machete, a skinny but sturdy piece of metal, an oxalic acid iron, oxalic acid, a quarter teaspoon, a respirator, flashlight, a hive tool, your smoker, and a 12 volt battery. Not shown in this image, you will also need a bucket of water and a rag. Before starting, I must warn you though, oxalic acid is highly toxic to humans. Additionally, this task runs a risk of electric shock with the 12 volt battery. On top of everything, we still run a risk of fire while performing this task. However, if you wear the proper personal protective equipment and follow these simple instructions, you will be able to safely and effectively treat your hives for varroa mite using oxalic acid vapors. To begin your mite treatment using oxalic acid vapors, gently smoke the entrance of the hive to send the guard bees back inside. You'll want your hive tool close by because you're going to separate the bottom of the hive with the hive body and slowly and gently remove your hive entrance. Once the hive entrance is removed, you'll pump puffs of smoke big puffs of smoke into the hive. Lots of smoke goes into the hive at this point. You're going to hear the hive buzz very loudly. Once you've gotten a sufficient amount of smoke in there, take a flashlight and peek into the hive to see what it looks like. If you see a ball of bees, then you should smoke a little bit more. You want your smoke to disperse the bees inside the hive. That will help your oxalic acid treatment dispense evenly through the inside of the hive. Now peek inside again. You see a little bit of wax there. So we need to clean that wax. That wax is a fire hazard. So that's what this machete is for. Scrape your machete inside the hive slowly, pushing it up against the frames. Now that long skinny piece of metal, like a coat hanger type thing, this is what you would use to scrape the wax out. Get it off of the bottom board. Now, go ahead and smoke your hive again. Send the bees back up. Grab your flashlight and take a look inside the hive. What you should see this time is the bottom of all of your frames with no wax and no bees. Now is the time to start your oxalic acid treatment. You'll take your oxalic acid iron and place one quarter teaspoon per deep box into the iron reservoir. This beehive is two deep brood chambers in height, so we will use two scoops. Now, put your oxalic acid iron into the center of the beehive, sliding it along the bottom. Make sure the handle is sitting on the porch of the hive. Now you'll turn your battery on and start your timer. Cover the entrance with a wet rag. And make sure you plug the holes up really well around the iron and all the way across to both corners. You don't want any bees coming in or out. And then you can walk away. Now inside your hive, this is what it looks like. At 1 minute and 30 seconds, we reach the melting point where the solid state of oxalic acid spontaneously becomes a liquid. That liquid then becomes a vapor. Your bees begin flapping their wings vigorously and moving this vapor all around the hive. The vapor will then coat everything in the hive, including the bees, and it will crystallize on 
everything. Now, at 4 minutes and 30 seconds, your iron should be about done, and you will want to disconnect the battery outside the hive. You can walk away and let the rest of the vaporization happen as the iron slowly starts to cool inside the hive. At 7 minutes, you can open your hive up and remove the iron. The iron is going to be very hot, so just dip your fingers into the bucket of water and drop a few drops, two or three drops, into the iron to help clean it. Now, you'll gently place the hive reducer back in, on to the porch, and you're done and you can move on to your next hive. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this, go to bmdooney.com.